Hey Taurus, this is your weekly reading for January 10th through the 16th. Let's go ahead and jump in with each other. You guys, I hope all of you guys are doing well out there. Taking care of yourself. Let's see what your angel number is from spirit here. Give me the angel number do you have here for Taurus? What message do you have here for Taurus? One more time. Okay, Taurus. Your angel number for this week is 19. Your positive affirmation is I am a pioneer. Okay, so paving the way for others here. Uh, that's what I feel like they're saying here, Taurus. Okay, so independence and self-sufficiency are necessities to you. <laughs> you are extremely capable in life. And you are and in work and aren't afraid to take big risks to achieve your life's desires here let's go ahead and grab one more angel number for you guys Taurus, you're showing up as a pioneer i'm not surprised that you are giving other people courage to believe in themselves and their abilities here that's what I feel is going on. This, <laughs> this one card keeps coming out for everyone. Maybe it's a message for the collective. That's what I'm saying here. Okay. So Taurus, you guys have 1255 coming in. I believe Aries got this and so uh, did Leo. Um, your card is saying you're being asked to trust and put faith in the divine energy. Trust the choices you have made up to this point. Nothing is random. Uh, the choices you've made um, may have seemed random and chaotic at times, but you're being reminded that every choice you made is leading you to living out your true soul's purpose on earth here. Your second angel, well, third angel number here is 2211. Okay. Your entire spiritual team, Taurus, is surrounding you. Always remember to assist, always ready to assist you. It's time to dig deep, unearth hindering beliefs, and listen to your superior intuition. Time to loosen your grip on all expectations and let go of assumptions. Forget the when, where, how, and who. Okay. Interesting. Let's see what else is coming in for you guys, okay? You're definitely being asked here, Taurus, this week to really believe in yourself. And in the event that you um, have questions or you feel lost in making a decision to call upon your spiritual team, that they are always ready to assist you. And possibly some of you guys need to let go of old belief systems. Okay? Definitely. Okay? Change your mindset here, Taurus. You have the Eight of Swords that's coming in. See how she's peeking out of one eye there? It... I feel like... Uh, this is definitely you needing to not restrict yourself, not restrict the way that you think about life and where you're going and what you're capable of doing. Uh, there may be some energy here that you are restricting yourself, that you're holding yourself back, that you have uh, stopped your own growth in some way here, okay? And I feel like they want you to change your mindset about um, how you're looking at your life and your situation to loosen your grip on all the expectations about how things may be happening in your life. Possibly you guys are um, too hard on yourself or you're trying to be a perfectionist here. That's what I'm feeling. Yes, you're more beautiful than you think here. You have the Empress card that's showing up here um, as well. You also have the Page of Pentacles. So don't, what you don't know, what you don't see is uh, these beautiful opportunities that are about to move into your life here. This is what you don't know here. This could be an opportunity in work, in school, and your finances increasing here. Um, there may be communication coming in with the Page of Pentacles that you've been waiting for. 
and it's coming in soon here someone is favoring you okay when it comes to your skill set and your ideas here okay so if you guys have been looking for a job or trying to get a career off the ground or an idea off the ground here okay i see some forward movement happening uh, yes your creative side is shining it's glowing here with the knight of cups uh that's showing up here as well this for you that's looking for a relationship here i do see messages of love or um someone moving into your life here uh cancer uh that's what i'm seeing here water sign or earth sign another taurus virgo capricorn pisces cancer scorpio that is a possibility if your focus is not on love here this week okay it's all about business <laughs> For you guys I hear some of you guys talking about business as usual um, this is about your creative side here and you being noticed for your drive for your creativity for your ideas um, and you being praised and uh, gaining new possibilities new opportunities here okay with the three of wands that's showing up here okay yes you have the full car coming in the three of wands the hangman and you also have the eight of pentacles so the weight is over that's what i'm feeling for a lot of you guys the weight of weight is over here you have planted some good seeds here taurus you have um that light is pretty bright sorry about that you have planted some good seeds here that's what i'm saying you have put in a lot of work time and attention towards your creations towards achieving some goals here in your life and i feel like all of this hard work this week will pay off you will start to see some forward movement or get some good news about um new possibilities new opportunities opening up for you this may be coming from a virgo um it's going to be or an aquarius you guys there's some new stuff that i see coming into your life with this full energy um that's showing up in your reading here it's it's going to be i feel like it for some reason it's going to take you guys by surprise maybe you're doubting yourself a little bit that you um may not receive something here but you have proved to be this pioneer okay with this um angel number coming in 19 saying you are a pioneer you need to repeat this positive affirmation i am a pioneer uh to tap into that energy okay um you have the knight of wands that's showing up here knight of swords excuse me knight of swords so um this is definitely you paving the way here for others. And I also feel like this is your own quick thinking and quick action. If you feel stuck, like I feel like some of you guys feel stuck. You feel like you're in this suspense type of energy here, okay? Contemplating, possibly meditating. Uh, some of you guys feel like there's a lot of delays in your life as well in regards to your own growth and development here. Um, I feel like uh, Spirit is saying with this uh, Knight of Swords that's showing up here that um, don't be too hasty here, okay? That opportunities will definitely move in and when they do, that's when you need to really take action here, okay? So I feel like there's also this message of you needing to be patient. Um, and like your card is saying with this 2211 to loosen the grips of expectations let go of assumptions here let go of the worry the restriction that you put on your mind your body and your spirit here and forget the when where how and who here because you have put in the work so far um some of you guys are just wondering when is these blessings coming in here okay when is all of these good things going to happen for me they're, they're going to happen soon i feel like uh what they're saying to me really is that it's going to happen in a uh, divine time here let's take a few more cards out and see what other messages they have for you guys here so you have the three of cups uh that's showing up in your reading here you also have the strength card 
that's showing up as well. So you need patience at this time. Patience at this time while, while things are happening in the background for you guys, okay? Um, I'm feeling within the next three to six months, you're going to see some significant growth and progress here. And I know this is a weekly reading, but um, and for some of you guys, this is going to happen even sooner. They're giving me six weeks here with this six of wands, but it's pure success for you here. It's victory here for you, Taurus, and whatever you're trying to work on, whatever you're trying to pursue in your life here, okay? I feel like uh, this week is all about your work, not so much a lover here. Even though we have the Knight of Cups, it doesn't feel like a partner um, in love, maybe a partner in business or a partner when it comes to um, your physical growth, okay? Your spiritual growth here as well. Um, I see you coming together with quite a few people here as well or having good people around you that encourage you. This could be friends at work. It could be friend, your friend circle here as well, Taurus, uh, people that give you uh, good energy cheering you on. Okay, make sure you keep those people around you here. Let's see what other messages Spirit has for you guys. Yeah, that's what it is, okay? Some of you guys feel like you're in limbo right now. Your card is saying as long as everything is still pending and not decided yet, you still, you should uh, stay completely relaxed with ease. Yeah, yes, okay? So some of you guys are waiting for communication, waiting for uh, news about something here. It could be a job, it could be uh, a loan that you're going after, um, uh, a home or an apartment here or some type of uh, financial situation that you're looking to improve that is coming okay no worries with the page of pentacles that's coming in here this is manifesting in your life new beginnings are coming in towards you you'll have the opportunity to step into this new energy or receive what you have been waiting for Four. That's why you have this limbo card that's showing up here. They're saying relax though with ease. Okay, you didn't get a no. Okay, the the answer is still yet to be seen here. So there is no definite no. You cannot have something that you have been wanting here. This is have patience. It is coming. Okay, that's exactly what I feel spirit is saying. Okay, um, wholeness. Like I said, some of you guys are looking for a home or you're trying to put in for a home loan, gain a new residence here. But this house is kind of is is cracked totally in half here. So uh, some of you guys are not feeling whole. Maybe this energy that I'm feeling is you guys are living with someone. This is some some picture that they're giving me like you're living with someone or um, renting from someone and you're wanting your own getting you're wanting your own space okay because you need peace and serenity so some some of you guys are living with people and you don't want to be there okay you're trying to find a way out there is an answer coming there is a way out here uh just stay positive and keep working towards this goal here especially with the eight of pentacles coming in your card is saying with this wholeness here what's wrong with you what do you need now? Bring the light back into your life here. So some of you guys have to work towards bringing this light back into your life. You have to take positive steps towards whatever you're trying to manifest in your life. So get out there and go for it, okay? Start to plan and make plans towards your future here, okay? And in your current moment, start to take action here with the three of wands that's coming in, okay? Preparation. When this card comes up, uh, I feel like they're talking about you needing to prepare for something new, okay? So get yourself ready. Let's see what else they want you guys to know here what other messages do you have for Taurus one more time okay Taurus you have geez <laughs> you have street fight <laughs> that's showing up here okay 
Um, you are walking in the wrong direction. The path holds you back. This path holds you back here. So they want you to go in a whole new direction. Obviously, that's why you have the full card that's coming in here. Okay, the world card is the last card in the uh, major arcana here. And then you start off with the full card. Uh, when you go back into the major arcana, the first card in the in the um, in the major series, okay. So I feel like this is something new. This is something brand new. They're saying that you need to start over here, um, and that whatever you guys are doing whatever path you're on maybe that is causing you mental stress maybe those are causing blocks and obstacles here in your life with this eight of swords here uh where you guys are feeling um stuck restricted where you are okay so a new path is calling you here Taurus. okay it says this path hold you back wherever you are whatever you're trying to do maybe you just need to tweak one thing that you're doing okay in order to make a big change in your life it could be your mindset it could be um something that you need to do physically in order to change your situation here so they're saying instead of uh moving you forward this path is holding you back instead of moving you forward it is restricting you this could also be a person that you are dealing with as well here taurus gemini energy that i'm bringing in here um that's what i feel with that some of you guys are dealing with a gemini that may be holding you back libra um Aquarius here as well that's what I'm feeling but you can you have victory you can have victory over this situation here this is this is your last card the six of wands that's coming in here okay you see the beautiful sun shining um and the card is saying rebirth decolonization here okay so decolonize is to uh take something apart or um yeah take something apart here okay possibly you need to go off on your own and leave a, a person place or thing behind here um and find your own independence especially with the empress card that's coming in here i'm saying your own independence because of this pioneering card let's make this clear crystal clear okay the 19 that's coming in your angel number says independence and self-sufficiency are necessities to you it's important to you this week to start thinking about this to start making future plans to regain your independence or um if you haven't had it and you are just moving out of someone's home or um having a roommate here <sighs> okay it's time for you to be off on your own that's what i'm feeling like they're saying here uh this could also apply to a relationship or to a job as well some of you guys are worried about um financially being stable and not taking steps towards starting something of your own like you're wanting to start a business here okay so um planning is needed okay put your plans pen to paper and then put pen to paper and then start to execute uh, plans that you have ideas that you have here okay it will be fruitful your last card is optimism so they want you to be optimistic not pessimistic here about uh your life and uh what you're trying to grow in your life here okay it says um what would a child do now okay they will still be hopeful that they can receive what they want. That's how you're manifesting here, okay? Still worrying or going out to play. Um, make the most of the situation that you're in right now. Make it work for you, okay? That is your reading, Taurus. I love you guys. Make sure you guys... Uh, give this video a thumbs up if you got a message out of it okay subscribe to the channel if you haven't done so already and i will see you guys in your next reading take care tours bye